Yeah, let's just do one more clip here um, because I hate our audience and I want them to throw up. So, um, oh right, this oh, one so, we can't I'm miss so this. I'm so ready. Now, I'm so ready. Very important news story today. Very disgusting news story today. Well, I guess it's a few days old, but I think it took the majority report crew collectively a little while to get used to the grossness. So, warning: you might vomit at this video, but I think it's important to show Louis Gohmert, the dumbest congressman in America, having a very specifically odd malfunction on camera during a press conference. Allies, many times since 2000, two, <laughs> since 2000, 2001. There was an even closer up clip from the recount where they show his tooth completely falling out and then being knocked around in between his two cheeks in his mouth. Ah, he almost tooth, lost it. He's decomposing before our very eyes. He oh just lost his tooth. Here we go. Oh my God, this is the one. Oh, I get that. <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh, there goes the tech. There goes the uh, tech. That man oh. clearly needs to feed. Oh, oh, there gross. it is. Ooh. That is so oh, gross. Sticking to uh, and Bender, this was more of a thing when wow. you were on MR all the time. Okay, the off, off. My eyes are tearing up. Right. Yes. The Gomericans. Right. Louis so Gomer. So the theory the whole... there would be that would be a bug device. <laughs> Gomer was some sort of secret right. Russian operative. This was before, you know, all the Trump Russia stuff when all the other GOPers were like, you know, going over to Russia and like, you know, talking about how great Putin rides horse rides horse shirtless and gomer was one of those guys so i'm i'm i don't know if we look at that closer i think we should probably watch it again no i don't uh, because think so. i think uh, <laughs> i still have it might have been a listening device um, i still I, have michael you can michael play it again Sam's. i might look away oh my god i can't look away <laughs> ah! looks electronic folks i think i still have michael and sam's oh, saying saying again? comrade in louis gomer's voice in my head Lost my tooth, comrade. <laughs> oh my god! You know? Oh my god! Why do I keep looking? Uh, maybe it's a recording device, or maybe uh, that man just needs a pint of child blood, stat. Here, here's the thing, though. I would, if listen, if that happened to me, if I lost the tooth while I was talking or whatever, I would not trust the tuck method because I would be too worried I'd swallow it, and there goes my there goes my tooth. Mm -hmm. I would honestly just come go come clean. Oh, hold Hold up, everyone. Drop my tooth. My tooth fell out. Don't want to drop it. Don't want to lose it. And I just hawk it up in my hand. <laughs> so the tuck method means you put it in between one of your, your gums and your cheek. That's what it is? Yeah. Yes, because you don't want, because he's actually, he's going to take it to the dentist and he's going to see what could be done. Right. He's not going to just <laughs> toss it. No, right. He did not skip a beat. That man is clearly a pro. Yeah, but I think that tooth might be shot if it just falls out like that and decays. Yeah. I, uh, I, like, that yeah. was... It's on par like... with Ted Cruz's <laughs> mysterious white thing. Like that also made me. Oh, the spittle. Ick. I feel like that happens a lot of the time when people get dehydrated. They just have this like thick white spittle that forms on their yeah. mouth that won't go away. I had a screenwriting right. professor who would have it pretty much every single class he's period. A, he's right. a dry boy. We got a. Any of you, any of you, any of any, ever you, any. Ha Ever, yeah, I can't even talk anymore. I'm <laughs> too much watching Gomert's uh, I'm disgusted. But any of you ever Do had I a have professor my teeth left? Who, like I feel teeth like all my teeth out are during wrong. class. No, we've all had that horrible, horrible dream, right? Where yeah, we were talking about that actually the I other actually day haven't. in the, in the pre-show because uh, it's 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 the sign if you're feeling insecure or something, you have uh, a, a dream where your teeth fell. Uh, or fall out. out yeah i actually have like a built-in retainer on my bottom four teeth I have um, the same still thing. yeah and i i like it's been there for a while and i was just having this discussion like should i get it taken out but i i actually get paranoid that just once it's gone my teeth will just fall out <laughs> oh, <laughs> not a real not a real fear yeah there's some of my most vivid dreams like i i literally th wake up thinking like oh i guess i this tooth is loose and i'm just gonna take it out i guess and it feels so real yeah it feels so real in your dream so like that's maybe why i have that visceral reaction but it's also just the 
the feelings I'm imagining like it clanking around and touching your other teeth yeah. and like it just being swirling around in them. Oh, all right. Imagine I think chewing said- a tooth. Oh, I've yeah, never yeah, had yeah. these dreams. What's wrong with you guys? The dream I always, the dream that I've always had and always affects me is I always have a dream where I forgot to go to a high school class. Yes, I, I mentioned this one directly after when we were talking about oh it. Oh my god, I'm actually. so sick of those dreams. I'm so sick of high school. It was such a long time ago. I took all the classes that I needed to. I swear. Yeah, I never. I go. never. Would, yeah, I never cut. I never skip class. Yet I have these dreams where I forget about a particular class on my schedule oh, for I the entirety for the <laughs> entirety of the uh, semester. And then I suddenly remember at the end of the semester that I forgot to go to this class. Mm -hmm. And then I wake up in like a deep sweat worrying if I'm going to pass. Then I'm like, oh, wait, I graduated from high school. What? 16 years ago. What's what's going on? Uh, Yeah, I had a more about college. It's often a cross between high school and college for me, which is yeah. its own kind of messed up. That's so but, interesting. But um, yeah, but I, I often times at I the have, end. I'm oh, sorry, gone. At the end of the dream, especially when I'm just trapped in high school, I usually remember. Wait a second, I went to high school and college, and I'm 35 years old, and I don't have to be here. And then I just leave great i have dreams that i miss the show that i oversleep and miss the show yeah i have dreams about this show where nothing works and Uh, sam uh, is just yelling (laughs) oh i've had i had i had i have had a few dreams where i walk into funny enough the old studio in the closet in uh in the shadow of the the empire state building where i would walk into the studio and sam would be on the floor like trying to untangle a giant thing of wires (laughs) Oh and God. and he'd turn around when I'd walk in, and he'd be furious that I <laughs> left that. <laughs> that seems pretty uh, true to true to life. Real. Yeah. 